Retinal detachment uh, is a peeling away of the retina from the wall of the eye, usually associated with high degrees of short sight, can be associated with trauma, and other more unusual injuries in the eye. Patients will often notice a shadow coming into the vision, as unfortunately the retina peels away and function is lost. We do have very successful techniques for surgical repair. And in recent years, vitrectomy surgery has become the gold standard for the vast majority of retinal detachments. Vitrectomy surgery is carried out by making small incisions as the patient is lying down in the eye theater. The eye is not taken out of the eye socket. Small incisions are made in the white of the eye, the sclera, three small incisions. And this allows the surgeon access to the space Behind the lens, the jelly is removed from the eye. This is the vitrectomy process. And this then gives access to the retina itself, where the surgeon can then apply laser treatment, freezing treatment, suck out fluid from behind the retina, and usually insert a bubble of gas to hold the retina in place. Depending where the hole in the retina is that's causing the detachment, I may ask patients to lie in a certain position so that the bubble floats and presses on different parts of the retina, holding it in place while the freezing and laser treatment work and provide a long-term secure seal, keeping the retina in place. Vitrectomy surgery for retinal detachment is around 90% successful for most retinal detachments. Unfortunately, without treatment, the majority of acute retinal detachment will result in complete loss of vision and surgery is fairly urgent so if you do have any symptoms consistent with retinal detachment, which would include flashing lights, floaters, or a shadow in the vision, you must contact an optician or ideally an eye surgeon uh, on an urgent basis within a day.